Hey, I don't have an intro. Alrighty, guys, we're back with it. And no, I'm not gonna do any gotcha this time, because you all have made me burn through my tickets, and there's no... Oh my god, is your ankle okay? Anyway, yeah, no gotchas. No starting gotchas with this. You guys are making me burn through my tickets, and it's funnier for you to see that I have tickets and that I don't use them. You see that? You see that? Beautiful. Anyways, we are continuing with uh, Bailu, the nerd, Don Hung, and Ting Yun. Uh, for people who care about this kind of thing. Uh, I got, everyone's level 40. I haven't done the equilibrium yet because I just don't care. I don't want to. Um, everyone has a light cone that is also level 40. Bailu has the quid pro quo here. Ting Yun has mesh and cogs uh, requested by the comment section. The nerd here has the genius's repose. And Don Hung has this one that I drew in the last gotcha. I like this one quite a bit. Level 40, only silence remains. Um, I've I've thought about switching to other people. I, I'm i enjoying this nerd way more than I thought I would. And you know, I might be that way with other people in this, but uh, like Arlen, I'm sure Arlen's really cool. Like he seems like he would be cool. Uh, I just probably won't ever play him because he's like a 14 year old boy and I just I don't care. Pella seems pretty cool. Pella's just like short people tights. Uh, I don't like Pella because the two times that I've spoken to her in the game, she's told me off. Uh, Asta, just no. No, too, she's, she's cute, but she's just a little too quirky. I know way too many people in real life who are obsessed with Zodiac, so it's just a turn off here. I love Natasha to death. I used her in my other playthrough. Amazing healer, beautiful. But on this account, uh, we had Bailu, so. Nothing against Natasha, just Bailu's the healer for this one. Serval, amazing, awesome, great. She can hop in my party whenever she wants. Protagonist, protagonist is pretty cool. I like preservation protagonist. Uh, we might end up tossing him in here someday. Uh, I just love Don Hung too much to switch him out. Anyways, let's continue, shall we? I have no idea where we are, but a lot of the comments said that I'm like 90% of the way through like the base 1.1 game. So whenever we finish that, I'll probably make another trailer video. Where's the monster for this? Oh my god. Do it. Whew, we almost did not make that. <laughs> we almost did not make that. Oh shit, now everybody's dead. Well, this is awkward. Pay me back with more sugar. What a lovely young lady. Uh, world anchor, thank you. Uh, oh, hello. Well, that path's destroyed. Oh, my God. Oh. That scene. Oh, look. The ambrosial arbor's roots. Why are Welt and Tingyun so far apart? Uh, they've uncoiled the Artisanship Commission's most precious invention, the Creation Furnace. That's a big stone lantern, dude. Help me, dear young friends. Let's hack them away together! We can't let the roots punch through the furnace! <sighs> March's facial expressions are so gold in this game, dude. Uh oh. Careful, it's changing. Hello? Oh, what the pollination? Aren't you that thing from the General's cutscene? Did a deer just come out of a tree? What kind of monster is this? What the? Miraculous. It creates life at will. Such incredible power. Who's your voice? That's the second time your voice has gotten so wild. Wait, what is it, week two? Uh oh, it's week two. Your stuff. Oh, we, we got slow motion. Oh no. Clemency? Never heard. Luck of the draw. 
Please, 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 please. Your hand's please. shaking. That's so funny. <laughs> Looks like victory. It's smacked. Uh oh, that was a cool animation. Looks like somebody needs a dog. Look, listen, feel, kick. Take that, you <laughs> ass hat. Oh, gotcha's with me. Oh, that was cool as shit. What is that effect? What? Okay, let's get rid of that. That's a problem. Oh, you asshole. It's guarding the Ambrosial Armor's roots and fruits. Counter? Outraged? Pilot, what are you doing? Hello? Better late than What? Fights are like gambling. <laughs> Ow. Let's be friends, shall we? You you gotta go. You are a problem. Step aside. I have to I need somebody to hit this thing, damn it. By the way, I really need you back. Oh pain! The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. This century. What did that say? Abundant. Ooh, abundant ebon deer. Somebody needs a doctor. Yeah, we. We do. <laughs> Time to show. What's in your prescription? Yum, yum, yum. Bye, yum, yum, yum. Good, good, good. Get rid of that. Customers are always welcome. Evil has begun. A thousand wonders to ring. Good omens. Fight has won. Clemency, never oh, touch. I now. totally misclicked that. You absolute can. Healer's OP. Healer's OP. We'll have to retreat for now. Follow me. Oh, thank God. I'm sitting here like, dude, do I actually have to do this? Is this like a damage check? Like a built-in DPS test in the game? Oh, great. Now we're getting chased by a deer through the Cianjo. Huh. No wonder the Cianjo is so scared of the abominations of abundance. They're unstoppable. Zombie apocalypse. Miss Ting Yoon. Are the long wave species on the Sienjo all like this? What? 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 I'm afraid this ebon deer was likely birthed by the Ambrosial Arbor as its guardian. It shares a close connection with the Arbor's roots. Most living creatures on the Sienjo don't have abilities like this. Yeah, I would assume. Uh, as long as it's there, we can't get any closer. The Evan Deer seems to heal itself instantly, but perhaps it's drawing that power from elsewhere. <laughs> They're both like, oh! So if we follow the roots, we'll find the hell. It's blasted this with the roots! Are you listening to Mr. Yang? Yeah, we just blow up the other thing. The monster only seems to be active in the vicinity of the arbor. Let's look around and see if we can find anything. Gong Shu, any, any rhymes you can help us with, my boy? So the general asked Thank you, you to head to the Alchemy Commission. Yes. Uh, the Artisan Ship Commission had no choice but to halt operations once the Tree Demon appeared. The Tree Demon, yes. <laughs> then switch it up to the nerd. The suckers. Anyways. Hello, mate. Young friends, I have a suggestion. Any thoughts, Master Gongshu? Have some coffee. Hmm. Good stuff. Hmm. When the deer revives, the surrounding roots glow brightly. Wait a minute. Oh, great observation, Mr. Gongshu. It's amazing what you notice when you're not fighting. What? March. 
For someone who hates Ting Yun, that was a very Ting Yun heavy line. It's like, what did that mean? Is that a compliment or an insult? <laughs> I'm only an artisan after all. My skills in Clash of Swords shall find no sake. Yet that which clasheth needeth hands to make. Facts. As Mr. Yang said. Yeah, who makes your bow, March, huh? Who makes your bow? Power from somewhere in order to replenish itself. I'm certain that when the arbor glows, we are witnessing that very process. Actually, you know what? March probably doesn't need the bow. Because, like, in one of the first cutscenes in Bellabog, she just turns around and freezes a bunch of gun barrels. I don't think March actually needs the bow. I think... And, oh, that's right. Oh, my God. Hold on. My brain's working. When we first got here, she froze that dude's wound shut. Dude, I bet March, if if she had, like, if she goes through her villain arc, I bet she would be such a fucking dangerous individual. Literally just walks past somebody and freezes them. My God. Precisely. You remember how we untangled the shifting screen with fire? Yes. Well, you're right. Those roots never grew back. They didn't. Not only that, its reaction suggested we'd hurt it. Perhaps that's our starting point. Yeah, let's go hurt things. Well, take hold of your weapons, young comrades. Let's raise these roots to the ground. Ah! Anyways. Uh, that's good. That's good. Oh, no, wait. That's not good. I see what we gotta do. No. Man, you would think I would know the difference between clockwise and counterclockwise. You power down. See? My theory was <laughs> See? Keep going. Oh, I love that you're ranged. It's so fucking beautiful. I can just like snipe shit. Hello? <gasps> hit the button, hit the button, hit the button, hit the button. Yeehaw! Also, I got it wrong when I was thinking of the teleporters for the other game. Uh, hello? Uh, I don't think I went the right way. Oh no, I absolutely went the right way. Never mind. That really had me going. No, no, stop. Go back. Go back. Go back. Ting, you fix it. Ting, you fix it. Okay, everyone, look cute. Nobody saw that. God, I like actually panicked. Jesus criminy. I mean, it's gotta be past the enemies, right? Let's just uh, run past you guys real quick. Thank you, thank you. Don't mind me. <clears throat> a, I'll never make that. There's the controller. Quick! There's more roots over here. Give me a moment. I don't like that it's like dark and evil. Is that how like in the trailers the abund they really painted the abundance out to be like kind of evil? So I, I wonder if oh, okay no. But yeah, they like made the abundance out to be really evil, and I wonder if that's because of the Stellaron or maybe the abundance just like doesn't care how much something continues to like grow and like guess we're done just like gr like make itself like sh estranged again like a zombie apocalypse type thing that's technically kind of propagation and growth the right the arbor's root system must have spread far underground the only thing we can say with confidence is that we removed the majority of those within the bounds of the artisanship commission i see let's hurry before they have a chance to grow back so, the next step is... Go say hello to our very dear friend. Get it? Please never do that again. Your first line in this game was have an ice day. I don't want to fucking hear it. Can, what the fuck is this? 
Hello? Oh, it's a lift. Okay. I got so scared. I thought this thing was about to unfurl like a damn, like, scroll and turn into a staircase. Mm. Oh man, I was, I was drinking coffee. That scared the f out of me. This was strength. A little something for everyone. <laughs> cool. All right, dear, we meet again. Look, the roots coiled around the creation furnace. They've withered. They've withered. Excellent. Nothing can stop you now. Dear, I'm about to body you. And I won't even need a YouTube premiere to do it. We're in trouble now. We've almost begun. A thousand wonders to raise good omens. That was a waste, but I just need her to get powered up. There's a crit. Thank God, that mom. Luck of the draw. Gotta get rid of these roots as fast as possible. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Looks like victory! Back again. Get by, Lou. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Fuck yes, dude. The tiles. <laughs> get messed up. Customers are always welcome. <laughs> yeah! Still slowed? Oh, I hope that lasts a little longer. Man, you really like to summon those, don't you? Oh. Somebody needs a doctor. Um, nope, nobody here needs a doctor. Fights are like gambling. You have to choose when to strike. I mean like this? Oh, that didn't work. You mean like this? Better late than me. Oh, it worked. I mean, I knew that would work. That damage was fucking nuts. That damage was insane. Oh, the true slow debuff is gone. Oh well. Get messed up, dear. Good thing I have also an abundance person. You fucking deer. What's in your prescription? Don't worry about me. A moxicillin. Wait, what? We have skill points, guys. We can do this. Oh my god, we actually did it. I love you to death. Time for the dance. Fuck. Oh, you are way cooler than I thought you would be. Oh my god. Oh no. Huh? Peaches. I am what did that say? Hungry. Lavish fruit. March. March. I can welt. When there are two lavish fruits on the battlefield, the Bonadu will immediately use flamboyant gore. Oh. Never heard Okay, that's half. Oh, oh, it's about to be all of it here in a sec. Good omen. Yes, buff everyone, my future ex-wife. Wait, what? A third one? Oh, this has to go. We have to stop now. No, 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 you're not allowed. Please, 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 please. Looks like. Get fucked. <gasps> oh, you have to go now. Better late than now. Oh, and you are about to go for sure. Step aside. The tiles now. Okay, and that's dead now. 
Oh, that's not good. Outraging. I literally could probably just kill the deer, but we're not gonna. Oh, that's pain in my face. The truth of life and death revealed in an instant. This century is but a vision. Get that chunk damage in there. Excuse me? Oh, nice heal. It's like gambling. You have to choose when to strike. Like right now. Part of the cards guide me. Oh my fucking god, it worked. Time for the pay Oh, fuck. Clemency. I love this character with a passion. Here's the crit. Good. Are you good? You're good. Evil must be gone. Go. Oh, you did not, you asshole. Oh no. Step aside. I have no interest in. Oh, that's the healing one. Wait for the tiles, but we don't need this tile. Wow. Good omen! Fight test one! Luck of the draw! Please, 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 please! Honestly, like, with how much damage she does and how lucky I get with her tiles, I probably could put, like, Preservation, uh, Trailblazer in. Oh, you are really, really enjoying this, aren't you? Clemency? Never heard of it. Let's be friends, shall we? There we go, and then. Well, listen, feel quick. Better late than never. Go forth, nerd. I do like gambling. Ooh, that's not good. My god, we gotta get rid of that real quick. <laughs> Time to show Make it so that you never use that ultimate. What's in your Tasty. Yeah, baby. Tasty. Is that the nerd that said that? Step at a time now. Do characters have voice lines with certain teammates? Don Hung. Don't worry about me. Wait for the tile good heal. All right. Come luck. Oh, that's oh my God! There's no fucking way. Time for the chaos. He's like, oh, I heard you like tree roots, so I got some trees for your roots. Don Hung, you you got to do the thing, buddy. Clemency? Never. The truth of life and death that crit revealed in an instant. This century is but a vision. That's good enough. Easier said than done, March. A thousand wonders to rain. Good omens. Fight us one. Luck of the draw. A quartet. Woohoo! I just noticed the name of her ultimate. <laughs> Looks like victory! Mm. That's right, take a seat, dear. Slayer of a very dear friend. Oh, we win. We win. We win. You lose. Get Mara struck. General Jing Yuan said the Ambrosial Arbor was an unfathomable celestial blessing. At first glance, that deer could have been an ordinary life form, but the ability to heal such grave wounds in an instant. I think I finally understand why the Sienjo decided to follow the hunt in eradicating the abundance. It took you a whole fight to come to that conclusion? As soon as I realized that the abundance would support a, like, universe-wide zombie apocalypse, I instantly understood, well... If 
Immortal creations were left to spread their branches and roots throughout the universe. Entire ecosystems would collapse. No wonder the people of the Sienjo wander the universe, never settling on a planet. You are a man of vision, Mr. Yang. Vision and reason. It's a shame our ancestors, the Elixir Seekers, were unable to see that hidden curse 8,000 years ago. Hindsight's 2020, even if you're 8,000 years old. Perhaps some of them did reject the Plague Author's gift. But how could an entire civilization resist the temptation of immortality? Facts. <sighs> Ironic, isn't it? The wise are buried, while the Lies. fools remain immortal. The Sienjo regrets being led astray by the abundance. That's why they have decided to embark on the path of the hunt. Maybe it's not too late for redemption. Thank you for your it's help. It's never too late. Sasuke taught I me that. I realize you must continue not on really. to the Alchemy Commission, to the Ambrosial Arbor. After witnessing what happened here, I know there will only be more danger ahead. I really Go thought we would meet Don Hung over here. Stay vigilant. I wish you a safe journey. Oh, everybody's so happy. Especially me, apparently. My goodness. It's the face I make when I get a cup of coffee. Oh my, ma'am, you're right next to me. Why? Say, did you see that benefactor? When the ebon deers stomped the ground, branches sprouted out of nowhere. Yeah, I, I didn't miss that. Those must be Ambrosial Arbor's roots. The celestial traces of abundance are indeed marvelous to behold. This is the first time I've seen something so miraculous among all my travels. The fruits on those bows are sparkling gold, just like the Sienjo legend says. She's typing fast. It is said that in ancient times, the former Sienjo were these immortal fruits like this. Ah! <laughs> it's over. I died. That's it. Uh, it is said that in ancient times, the former the Sienjo received immortal fruits like this of the ambrosial arbor and turned into lifelong species. If I were to eat this fruit, would I obtain endless life just like the Sienjo natives? Are you not tempted by such a chance? Oh, I was tempted. Oh, okay. Me in real life. I don't know. That's such a weird thing because like... Not to get into a real subject. If you don't if you don't like talks of life and death, I, I recommend you mute the video for a little bit. Uh, but like obviously, you know, death. real, Very real concept for everyone living. So, you know, obviously the draw of immortality is an amazing thought in reality. But like... I don't know. Like, I think if it was like a switch, like I could pick when I come and go, that would be, I would do that, you know? Cause like, I, there are no humans who have lived forever, right? So like, no one knows just how shitty that would be, right? Oh, you would see all your loved ones die. It's like, well, yeah, but like, you know, you're a person, you can meet new people all the time. You know, people come and go out of your life every day. You know, you talk to a stranger, you go to work, you get fired from a job, you get a new job, you get a new hobby, you meet people. Like, that process never stops from the day you're born to the day you go, you, you, to when you experience the final yeet. So I wonder, you know, if there's like a threshold, like two, three hundred, four hundred years when finally it kind of all starts setting in and you just like don't remember the beginning. I don't know. I feel like if I ever hit that point and I was like immortal, I would want to be able to like hit a button and be like, all right, cool, it was fun, I'm out. I don't know, like unless there were like other immortal people that I didn't mind, I, I, I don't know. I don't know, it's such a, it's such a nifty hypothetical. Such a nifty, like I already can't remember what happened yesterday for the most part, let alone caring about what happens tomorrow. I say as I have like four long-term life plans in check right now. Uh. If she eats that fruit... Well, they don't have endless lives. They eventually go crazy, which I think you're just gonna do anyway. Am I tempted by it? I'm a trailblazer. I'm I'm burning through life. I don't think I could do it. I, I think it's a dangerous thought. Oh! <gasps> 
She was, guys, she was testing us. We passed the test. Of course, they haven't do is now dust and no fruit of the birds are left behind. Such opportunities are extremely rare, but they slip away in the blink of an eye, just like life itself. You're like 400, I don't want to hear it. The age of 400's in demand, I hear. Oh, her head turned. And what was that little bit? Windswept wonderlust? Desolate depths of despair. Top clouded, whatever the fuck that was. Oh, <gasps> dear sir. Shadow of preservation. What is that name? Oh, it's fucking Yukong's secretary, right? Oh, there's too many people messaging. I, oh no. Oh no, I don't get messages in real life. You all need to stop right now. Oh, there's another one. Oh wait, you I will answer, 100%. Hey there, I heard folk, nope, can't do it. Uh, the Artisan Commission say that you helped clear the Immersal Arbor Coils. You're indeed as saintly as the General says you are. That's me, all right. I am brave and kind and I love to help others. Great, a brave and kind person like you can definitely help me. Oh, this nerd. Do you remember the commission, the craftsman apprentice named Chinji from the Artist Commission? Uh, I kinda do. Then that's easy. I was sent here by the Master Diviner to assist the Artisan Ship Commission in assessing the damages. Everything was going well, but now the situation with it's changed. Uh, it's getting beyond my scope of work. Can you come over to find me? I'm at the Artisanship Commission's port. Oh, it's like a little random side quest. Oh my god, I have so many messages. Uh, let's just let's just burn through these. Uh, the Hexanexus Secret Society. We are called the Hex Club. Have you ever heard of the Hexanexus? Uh, that are countless people. The new rule masterpiece. The urban ship uh, resistance symbolizes Hexanexus. The Hexanexus. The Hexanexus. The Hexanexus. Verse burst path. Walk sorrow. The Hexanexus. The Hexanexus. Society's goal. Spread unforeseen joy. There is no such function. We are eternity. Did I have your name? Yeah, fuck you guys. I don't know who the hell you are. Get fucked. Fu you think I give a fuck? Go ahead and report me. I got fucking your general at my back. Like, I want you to have this same conversation with the Divine Foresight and let me know how that goes. You little assholes. What? <laughs> Who are you? I don't care. Okay, uh, Natasha, you, you, your message has been in here for a while. Did your cold get better? Did you take the medicine according to my prescription? My cold is gone. I know, I'm, I'm getting something. I feel my tonsils a bit swollen, but we'll see how that goes. But I can get some of the ingredients in your prescription. Oh! Bellabog specialties, they don't have those on the express. Cry. Oh, she is not amused. Oh, okay. The road is trailer the healthier bodies. But most important, you just take care of yourself. Thank you, Nat. She's so lovely. We're on another planet, and she's looking out for us. All right, Asta. Oh boy, it's been a while. Is everything all right? I heard you gone to the Cienju La Lufu. Oh God. Uh. I know the Express is there to carry out the Trailblaze missions, but there is a question about the Sanjo I'd like to ask. Uh, have you heard of the local legend of the Sanjo, the Foxy and Beauty online chat? No, no, I meant I'm interested. Go back. <laughs> I mean, I don't simp. You misunderstand me. The story starts from a certain staff member. I'm not saying the researcher is a Foxy and Beauty. Uh, this is too confusing. Let's meet in person to talk when you come back. You can come back to the space station and have a little chat with me face to face. I only care about the fox and beauty. <laughs> uh, speaking of Fioxian beauties. Fioxian? Foxian. Uh, I'm Shikui, Chief Secretary of the Skyfaring Commission. Uh, the Palace of Astrum is running a small event for visitors to better understand the Sandra. Would you be interested? A dreamy one-day tour? <laughs> Where did you get all these ideas? I haven't said anything. <laughs> uh, 
uh, has a speed tester named Tan Tan. No, no, go up. I can't read this, you lunatics. What makes you think I can read all this? Um... You know, the public could actively participate in traffic management and become more aware of potential road hazards. Is that it? I'm not here to learn traffic laws of a planet I'm going to be on for seven days and seven nights. That's too boring. So, Madam Yukong asked me to help her get more people. Would you mind? Oh, Yukong is there, you say. Well, keep talking. Just record the traffic flow through certain things. Simple. Just stay in the lane and count. So, you never share good things with me, but always ask me to help you when you're in trouble. This is a good thing, trust me. All the projects have a set budget. The fewer people involved in your project, the more individual benefits you'll get. If you're ready, please go find Tan Tan. <laughs> Fired. <laughs> what, what a mission name. Donnie Vic. Is, oh, is this the dude we talked to? Walk slower, don't leave your soul behind. What a dude. Uh, I'm official Daha from the Realm Keeping. Yeah, this is the dude we talked to before, who I thought sounded like Keanu Reeves, I think. Uh, minor issues on the Lao Fu recently. Anyways, I was hoping you could help me with something. Now, I can't do a Keanu Reeves impression. Oh, yeah, I mean, nope. I'd have to really think about that one. Uh, don't spread information following after the incident. The general and the master diviner ooh, drew up a list and wants Skyfaring commissioned us to check all the people who travel at certain times to certain locations. They suspect someone smuggled contraband on the Lao Fu. Yeah, so Stellaron, you know, no biggie. Uh, the commissions checked everything against the records and didn't find anyone suspicious, so we're here to ask your assistance. How do I fit in here? The Sandro Alliance is not a part of terrestrial. You fucking asshole. Stop typing. Uh, the Sanjo Alliance is not part of the Interastral Peace Corporation's commercial sphere and does not share much information with the IPC. For one, we are not linked with the law enforcement system. If a criminal wanted by the IPC snuck onto the Sanjo ship, we would have no means of immediately detecting them. It takes time and effort to send a formal request to the IPC to check, so the general advised us to seek help from the Astro Express crew to filter the list of any suspicious persons. If you can, please bring a few companions with you to help us go through. A Night Stranger. Oh, it's, it's a companion quest. Uh, I don't even have a budget of servants. I have something else requiring your assistance. Besides the companion quest? Remember the time you defeated the Mara Struck at the plaza and heroically saved the dragon lady? I do remember my lovely little healer. That's true. It was nothing, really. Uh, could you please take some time to visit the Realm Keeping Commission? I'll tell you the details in person. Uh... Of an essence, like the morning dew. I assume a Bailu companion quest? Not hung! Our star skiff went off course. How's the situation on your end? You have a signal? Yes, how's the situation on your end? We caught Kafka, but it was too easy. It was kind of odd. What about Kafka's companion? Did you see Blade? Kafka was alone. Kof goes alone when we caught her. What's the matter? Wait. Kof goes alone. Kof goes alone when we caught her. What's the matter? Be careful. He's very dangerous. I'll shake off the cloud knights and catch up to you. Wait, what's going on on your end? Oh, wait, well, well, know what we're doing next. Unable. Wait. Oh, we can't go in yet. Interesting. Hey, nerd, what's up? Not good for work or overtime. <laughs> oh, how I feel every day. Okay. I love this fucking character. Jesus Christ. Wait, what? What? Oh, yeah, I got your idol on. No shit. Uh, what, do, what, do, what do we got here? Earth Shaking Resonance. When you use your basic attack, additionally deals fire damage. You have 25% of the Trailblazer's defense. When the Trailblazer... When the Trailblazer uses their enhanced basic attack, additionally deals fire damage equal to 50% of Trailblazer. Damn, so it's just a damage buff. The value the first of choice one. lies in unwavering resolve. Interesting. Interesting. This game confuses. I don't understand why they give you all but one of the Eidolons for the destruction one. Unless you buy them and then you can get it all. But then by the time you get them all, you switch to this one, which is just better. 
And I'm assuming by the time we finish this one, we'll, un we'll have gotten to the point in the game where we unlock Harmony. Which I have unlocked, but I'm just not going to use it because I'm not a degenerate, spoiling asshole like that. I A lot of people talk smack about this place in... Hello? That almost startled me. Interesting. Um, but yeah, a lot of people talk smack about this game. Like, or not this game, no shit. Uh, this level, but I... I really like it. Yeah, I, I... A lot of people talk smack about this world on, like, the comments section and stuff. Whoa. I... I really like this level so far. Well, that was a bad camera angle. I did not mean to do that. I was looking at the sky. Um, here we go. I've really liked it so far, and, like, to know that the world after the next one, we're coming back to the... Oh, who is the best boy over there? There he is, who's a doggo? Oh, he's dead. Ooh, that's awkward. Uh, whoa. Looks like the battle here was in. What is this face? The Master Diviner must have launched the campaign while we were delayed in the Artisanship Commission. Oh, she started without us. Yeah, I really can't. Indeed. Since General Jing Yuan tasked the Master Diviner with commanding the Cloud Knights, he must have known she'd act on the results of her divination. Yeah, kind of like what Yan Ching said. Like, she's been wanting the position for a while, so she probably got really gung-ho motivation when he did that. Thank goodness the General didn't make us go with the Knights. Fighting is totally different from adventuring. Is it much? All these people. It's tough to bear. I think we just haven't lost yet. That's why you haven't experienced what you're I'm thinking of. I'm afraid this is nothing, Benefactor. Centuries ago, an emanator of abundance besieged the Lafu with the aim of what? the Ambrosial Arbor. They destroyed half our delves and killed most of the Cloud Knights. What? For long life species, such events are more like yesterday's memories than ancient history. This oh, what a perspective! Child's play in comparison. What a perspective! Hey, is that supposed to make us feel better? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> it's hard to tell if the Master Diviner won or lost here. Why do they have the sound effect of a love dove in the background? That's funny. Yeah, let's let's set the bar. Draw? This isn't a tournament, you know. I can't see many cloud knights. The Sienjo must have fought well. Not necessarily. There'd usually be a base with supporting forces set up after a successful engagement, but we don't see any of that. I mean, the hunt's pretty gung-ho and straightforward, Wilt. I don't know if they'll sit back and contemplate a reason like that. Let's look around and see if we can find some clues. I think I'll probably confide in Ting Yun more about this one. She has more uh, enlightenment about this, I think. Be careful. Those monsters are pretty tough. Look at this doggo! He's so cool! What in the Digimon-looking motherfucker? My god, hello. A quick Look, read. There's someone over there! Who's this person? What? <gasps> hello? Here! There are still survivors here! March, hold on. There's a chest. I need to go get that. <clears throat> You're not the knights. What is your purpose here? It's dangerous. What the fuck are you doing here? We're oh, you're a healer. No shit. General. Where's I saw the name the last else? second. <laughs> Resorting to short life species as reinforcements. <laughs> Jing Yuan is truly running out of options. <laughs> Run! She's a disciple of Saintus Medicus! Oh! Silence. If my healing worked, you'll become one of us. What? And then it's not just me they'll be running from. What? Wait, what are we gonna be fighting? Oh. Hurry. Leave here. Are always welcome. Oh, yes. I can't control 
What is this background? What is the background? I can't really get a good angle on it. Oh my god. Oh, I just beat up. Now. No interesting conflict. Wait for the tops. <laughs> Oh my god, what? What is happening? A thousand wonder Why is there like brand new creatures all of a sudden? The truth of life is death. But the vision. I'm gonna be fair, the Sanjo is literally like a fucking planet, so. So it's probably got a ton of species we've never heard of before. Oh shit, these guys are cool looking. What is that thing? Let's be friends. Oh, I attacked the wrong number. Can we talk? Oh, that thing's fancy. Wait for the ties. Um I got points. Let's do this shit. Do it. Yes! Action advance. Welcome, customers. Oh, you sleaze bag. It's meaningless. Why did you come to the skin to seek immortality? You don't have to be one. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus can provide all that you desire. Sorry, taking a swig of coffee. <laughs> a thousand wonders. Fight is gone. Oh, you're dead. He's got a rocket launcher. My god. Oh no. Oh, I have no healing. When they keep quiet. Let's be friends. Oh no. Violet, please. Good heels. Good heels. Oh my god, you're so annoying. Let me your wounds. Oh, get absolutely smashed. <laughs> Those are really cool enemies. Holy shit. Uh, hold on. We'll find someone to help. Well, oh man, I was gonna say, Welt said before we can like un Stellaron people if it's like fresh, but I don't know if we can un Mara struck people. Don't waste your time. They've converted me. I don't have much longer. Oh. Go. The Master Diviner's troops are ahead. He stops talking. Could be because he's exhausted or he's waiting for you to leave Let's him go. be. Yep. Walk on. Walk away. Walk away. The Nothing. disciples of Sanctus Medicus were in hiding for so long. Now they finally show their face. Did the Master Diviner fail to foresee this? Be careful, benefactors. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus worship Yaoshi, the plague's author, the greatest what enemy of the Sienjo. Fucking name. The Alliance has been trying to root out their secret organization for millennia. It's no coincidence that they've chosen this moment to reveal themselves. Ooh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that one, Chief. I will uh, investigate. It's like an accessible area. Why even make that investigatable? Uh, I'm gonna try and beat this, and if it works, I will. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope, just give me that guy. What? Just give me that one. Just give me that one. Yep. Oh, fuck you. I made that. Ow. Damn, I didn't get that healing in time. There we go. That was way, way, not as bad as I thought it would be. But I also killed those guys, so. Woohoo! Should I can invest it? Mm -hmm.
Hey, can you go away? I want to investigate that cloud knight. Thank you. Moving the helmet, you look straight in the face of the fallen cloud knight. An expression of agony is frozen on his face of this... Uh, uh, an expression of agony is frozen on the face of this Xian Shou. Man of indiscernible... Uh, of in uh, An expression of agony is frozen on the face of the Xian Shou. Man of indiscernible age. Find a cluster of mutated branches at the temples of his hair. He seems to have been subjected to the purgatory-like torture. To the... Wait, wait. And a cluster of mutated branches at the temples of his hair. He seems to have been subjugated to purgatory-like torture before his death. My god, a game. Hey, buddy. A painful mode amidst the ravaged battlefield draws your attention. Rainbow's blessing. You're not disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Stop moving around. Let's see if there's a way to help you recover faster. Come on. <laughs> Temporarily give up. Help with your injuries. Uh, here we go. Oh, we can actually do this? This is the thing? Ooh. Thank you. All of you. I feel much better now. Is this a male character model? Thank goodness you're here. The garrison is up ahead. Are you heading there now? I'll wait there for you. Oh, we just saved somebody. Oh, I haven't got a praise of high morals in a while. Not since the trash. Not since the trash. Not since the trash. There's no trash cans in Sienja. No wonder this place, no wonder no one likes this part of the story. My God, this sucks. Hello? <gasps> running, 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 running. Violet, don't get hit. Okay. Well, hello. Is that an ocean? Like I've been wanting to look at this background for a while now. My God, what? This is what a Sanjo Ocean looks like? What the f is going on over there? They have oceans on their boats? Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, that's big. Oh, hi, doggo. When the, where the fuck did you come from? All right, this is gonna be the last part of this video. I didn't realize how long we were in it already. <gasps> oh, safety. Who goes there? Show yourselves! I am Welt, and this is my, uh, company. Lee. It's you. Quickly, in here. It's dangerous outside. You recognize us? Are you not the General's guests? The Master Diviner prophesized your arrival. We were ordered to wait for you under any circumstances. Prophesized? She just knew we were coming. Yes. The Master Diviner ordered us to remain stationed here and went to Scott ahead. They're saying the disciples of Sanctus Medicus have returned. Yep, that's they, right. The 40k faction is here. Age. The troops are anxious. It's good that you're here. The Master Diviner said the knights weren't to move out until you arrived. You arrived? Please wait in the camp. We'll decide on our next steps once the Master Diviner returns. Well, shit. That the Cloud Knights received orders not to advance is a bad sign. Yep. The Disciples of Sanctus Medicus. I have heard the name before. If memory serves, they're an underground sect of the Abundance that's said to have lain dormant within the Sienjo. Yeah, we put that together already, well. Overthrow the Alliance. Oh, that was a talk between the General, that's right. The we Stellaron has certainly caused Abundance-like abnormalities. Is that what motivated the Disciples to come out of the shadows? No. The Knight's main force remains intact. Something must have happened. Something we're not aware of. The Master Diviner isn't here. Let's head into camp and see what we can learn from the troops here. Sounds like a plan, Well, yeah. Why don't you take a look around, Benefactors? My feet need a rest. She's not used to physical labor. 
as she immediately stands up and goes shopping. God damn it, woman. Anyways, though, guys, that is where we're going to end this episode. Another lovely traversal through uh, Star Rail. Uh, not, like, looking back on it now, not 100% sure what the hell we am. Thank you. Um, we did a lot here. We, we, we accomplished quite a bit. Um, the story is amazing. I think I'm now officially in 1.1 content, so... Uh, probably advance a bit in this and then do another trailer video of like the 1.1 up to the 1.2 stuff. I don't know, maybe. Uh, anyways, though, I'm rambling. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Can't wait to see you for the next one. And thank you again to all the members who have joined. Uh, I'll probably end up posting uh, something in there. Uh, probably, I don't know, I'll probably have fun and just mess around with some things. But we'll do another vote here eventually. We'll, we'll talk. I'll welcome the new people. Uh, but again, rambling. Thanks for watching. Adios. Have fun. All. And join the members. She's so fucking adorable. My God.